Years ago, Ray and Ross of Pure Pens in the UK came to the New England area to the Commonwealth Pen Show, and we had a contest determining whether the American or the two people from England could win in terms of sales. And it, it might have been an unfair advantage to the home team. However, uh, Ray's smile always, always generated a longer line uh, than I ever could. And it was a very, very impressive performance by a master salesman. But they, they went home with whatever hadn't uh, sold out at that show. And in years since, now and again, uh, if that show doesn't quite consume everything, uh, they, they bring some back to our friends across the pond. And notably, when we have a limited edition for the show, it says Commonwealth, Commonwealth 2023. This year, the show was canceled. Labor problems in the Boston area, difficulty getting conferences uh, fulfilled. Well, uh, there are not many of these. Uh, I, I can't say that I was uh, anticipating a huge crowd, so there are 18 of each one of these. Well, it, it sort of has a name. It's called the pen with no name, literally. It's imprinted right on the side of the barrel there. There's some pictures, some still pictures of these. And it's imprinted Commonwealth 2023. Music nib, triple fissure, ebonite feed. A very familiar two-stroke filler. Put it in the ink, two strokes, and there it is. And a visuated half barrel so that you always see your ink supply. Oh, and it, it posts just fine. It's a very lightweight, comfortable pen. This is uh, Appalachian Pearl, and this is the colored acrylic, cast acrylic, it's a handmade pen, uh, that's called Forbidden City. And it's also the pen with no name. Two-stroke filler. Commonwealth 2023. That has always had a dual purpose because any part of the world's British Commonwealth you can send this to, as well as the limited number of states in the Union, including the Commonwealth of Massachusetts, that are known as Commonwealths. Some of these colors might be familiar. This one, I hope, becomes more standard. It's that Red Rebellion color that is sometimes seen in the Neponset, and hopefully it will be more readily available in the safety. These will not. Uh, there's about 20 of each one of the, the green and tan and the green and brown, uh, about 40 of this brown and black ripple. And that's it. And they're all in the UK. Uh, because there wasn't a, a New England show, and because the number of these pens w was not sufficiently large to uh, go through distribution in the US, uh, the UK seemed to be a perfect spot to send a uh, Commonwealth pen for the Commonwealth. And I hope our friends across the pond enjoy them, and I greatly appreciate the friends of Noodlers 
who are in England, Wales, Scotland, and Ireland. And I'll include both parts of Ireland because I have a lot of pr friends on the other side as well.